Hi, I'm Laura, and I'm going to be reading a poem by Edward Lear. It's called The Jumblies, and I chose this poem because I love how it reads. It's very fun, and it's cute, and I really like the meaning behind it, so I hope you like it, too. They went to sea in a sieve they did, and a sieve they went to sea. In spite of all of their friends could say on a winter's morn, on a stormy day, in a sieve they went to sea. And when the sieve turned round and round, and everyone cried, you all be drowned, they called aloud, Our sieve ain't big, but we don't care a button, we don't care a fig, and a sieve will go to sea. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue, and they went to sea in a sieve. They sailed away in a sieve they did, and in a sieve they sailed so fast, with only a beautiful pea-green veil, tied with a ribbon by way of sail, to a small tobacco pipe mast, and everyone said who saw them go, Oh, won't they be soon upset, you know. For the sky is dark and the voyage is long, and happen what may, it's extremely wrong, and they sieve to sail so fast. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue, and they went to sea in a sieve. The water it soon came in, it did, the water it soon came in. So to keep them dry, they wrapped their feet in a pinky paper all folded neat, and they fastened it down with a pin. And they passed the night in a crockery jar, and each of them said, How wise we are! Though the sky be dark and the voyage be long, yet we never can think we were rash or wrong, while round in our sieve we spin. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue, and they went to sea in a sieve. And all night long they sailed away, and when the sun went down, they whistled and warbled a moony song to the echoing sound of a coppery gong in the shade of the mountains brown. Oh, Timblow, how happy we are when we live in a sieve in a crockery jar, and all night long in the moonlight pale we sail away with a pea-green sail in the shade of the mountains brown. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue, and they went to sea in a sieve. They sailed to the western sea they did, to a land all covered with trees, and they bought an owl and a useful cart and a pound of rice and a cranberry tart and a hive of silvery bees. And they bought a pig and some green jack dolls and a lovely monkey with lollipop paws and forty bottles of ring ree and no end of silt and cheese. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue and they went to sea in a sieve. And in twenty years they all came back in twenty years or more. And everyone said how tall they've grown for they've been to the lakes and the terrible zone and the hills of the Chankly Boar. And they drank their health and gave them a feast of dumplings made of beautiful yeast, and everyone said, If we only live, we too will go to sea in a sieve, to the hills of the Chankly Boar. Far and few, far and few are the lands where the jumblies live. Their heads are green and their hands are blue, and they went to sea in a sieve.